What's up everyone? Welcome to the channel. So I'm finally getting a chance to do my MAC haul. A lot of these products I purchased back during the fall time. Now I'm actually getting a chance to film this haul. So let's just jump right so in. So pretty much all these products I got on sale, whether it's from the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty, purchasing them at TJ Maxx or Marshalls. Also MAC is pretty good with having sales on their website, like 40% off, 30% off. So, so let's go ahead and jump in. Uh, let's start off with whatever's in this Marshalls bag. So I ended up picking up this MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus, very popular. I use this all the time when I do my makeup. I do have another bottle that I'm using, but I really like this for setting, for prepping. It's a really good spray to have, especially when your skin is dry. And my skin is really dry. My hands just... I put so much lotion on it, it doesn't make any sense. All right, so the next thing that I'm actually really excited to try is this Studio Scope SPF 15 foundation. This one I purchased at Marshalls for $14.99. Now I got a chance to try this and this is the shade NW35. I like the shade. I got a chance to play with this and it feels really lightweight and the coverage is nice for every day, especially when you go to work. So this is how it looks. So I didn't get a chance to wear it for a long time just to play around with it for like maybe 30 minutes. I had it on my face for about 30 minutes and I like how it felt. I like how it looked. It looked like my skin was really healthy and it wasn't a heavy foundation. I can't wait to really test these out. Another foundation, I picked this up at... This one I picked up at Marshalls. This is the Studio Fix Fluid SPF 15. I know this is a very popular foundation. I'm pretty sure, I haven't got a chance to use it. Only I only played with it just to see if the color would work for me. I think this is a, going to be a nice full coverage foundation. Definitely. So there's that. This is $14.99 at Marshalls and the shade is NC40. Now I did end up buying two concealers. One NC25, one NC30. They're the 24 hour smooth wear concealer. Studio Fix. One of them I purchased on the MAC website and the other I picked up at Marshalls for $9.99. So those are these two here. Concealers. Now this MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Powder I picked up on the MAC website a while back when it was 30 pissing off because I've always wanted to try this powder. I'm curious to see if it works as well as that Sephora Smoothing Powder and I absolutely love that smoothing powder, especially for setting my makeup and under my eyes. So here it is. I got the shade Medium Golden. The compact. Which is going to be a perfect shade for me. That's Medium Golden. So I'll let you know how this works compared to the Sephora powder. Because that Sephora powder, if you haven't tried it, it's really good get into a lipstick that I have. This one I purchased at TJ Maxx for $7.99. This is Velvet Teddy. This is really popular. Really popular lipstick. Here it is. That's Velvet Teddy. Give you a little swatch on my dry hand. <laughs> it's a really pretty everyday shade. I know it's a really popular shade. So I did end up finding a Dazzle eyeshadow, which is probably one of my favorite eyeshadows from MAC. This is the shade Slow, Fa Slow Fast Slow. And this I picked up at Marshalls for $8.99. Yeah, I do really like their Dazzle shades. So that's that. Really nice. You can see it there. Kind of like has a lot of pink to it. Really pretty. So I can't wait to use this. Um, a couple more things that I ordered from the MAC website were some popular items. So I picked up Soft and Gentle, the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish, and Give Me Sun, the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish as well. So let's go ahead and open. This was Give Me Sun. Very sleek. And this is going to be really pretty for like summertime. So this is supposed to be 
I'm gonna use this as a bronzer. And I know it's gonna be really nice for the summertime too. So give me sun. Can't wait to use this. I'm pretty sure I'll use it before summer because I'm going to do a shop my stash, I think with just MAC products. So look out for that. This is soft and gentle, very popular shade. And excuse the background noise. <laughs> Here's soft and gentle. It's really pretty. Really pretty, can't wait to use it. I'm gonna show you a lot of blushes that I got from Ulta when they had that 21 Days of Beauty. And a couple from, a couple from TJ Maxx and Marshalls as well. So this one is Swiss Chocolate. This one is from Marshalls, so that's Swiss chocolate. Really pretty, frankly scarlet, nice deep reddish shade. Really loud. I don't have anything like this in my collection. that so let's talk about the blushes that i got from 21 days of beauty so i picked up the the mac mineralized blush in gentle here's that that's gentle Really pretty and luminous. Sweet enough. Really nice pinky tone blush that you could use every day. Is that one? This is Lovejoy. I have to show you the shade. The last two, this is Humor Me. This is more of a brownish blush. Pretty neutral, I want to say. The last blush I picked up, it's one of the glow play blushes in blush please here it is this is also a nice everyday blush it feels really like putty like so this is blush please All right, guys, so that completes this MAC haul. I will be doing a Shop My Stash picking only MAC products pretty soon, so look out for that. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like, and comment, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.